Well, Max and I are over here to do a little fishing over here at Snapping Turtle Creek, huh? Yeah. Creek looks pretty good. We're going to be trying for pike, carp, bullhead, and whatever else bites. And on today's bait menu, we got some uh, frozen, frozen shiners. We got frozen shiners. That's on today's bait menu. And uh, oh, sweet corn. Got some geese right in front of us. Till Max starts barking at him. Let's give it a go, Mr. Goose. Who goose the moose by antlers in the treetop? Well, right now we're doing a little chumming with some sweet corn. So far we haven't had anything. Well, they're probably still pretty cold. They'll be coming around. So. We get some, we get some. If we don't, hey, we, at least we gave it. Right, Max? At least we gave it a try. We don't get skunked too often. We got a lot of tricks in our hat, don't we, bud? No, we'll try something different if this don't work. So. Stay tuned. Cut bait. Just had a hit on the chub, something hit it. But, it, but they dropped it. But it was a hit. May still be with it. it was a pike, I think, would just gone. Could have been a bass, who knows. But hey, it was a hit. I just had a good hit here on the live bait, boys. Let's hope it hits again. Getting ahead again. Got him. Fishing on. Fishing on, boys. It's a pike. Is that a pretty good pike? Fish on. Oh, yeah. First pike of the year, boys. All right. Little guy got that whole head. Nice little pike. Oh, yeah. All right, hello, Mr. Little Pike. <laughs> Just a little hammerhead, bud. There he is. Nice little pike, little hammerhead, bud. I'll get that hook out of him, and then we'll put him back. But hey, we didn't get skunk. We didn't get skunky. Well, we're going to let this pike go. It's just a little one. I don't even know if I even got it on film. Little hammerhead. Right, we're going to let him go, man. Hey, what are you doing? Waiting for the rest of the crab. Oh, yeah. Boy, that water is gold. Ooh. You know, you try to get the slime off your hands with water. It don't come off. That's why it's on the fish. It don't come off on the fish when they're in the water. So to get the slime off, you got to use weeds or rags or something. But I use the green paper towel. Getting a hit. Getting a hit on the cut bait. Okay. We still have it. I don't know for sure. Wasn't expecting that boom. But I'm liking the cut bait today. We don't have any live. That's all we got is cut bait. I probably could have hooked it, but I was going to let it run, but it stopped. Could still be on it though. If I could do that, they run, stop, turn around, and get it in their mouth, and then swallow it. Then the action starts. Hey Max, where are you? Well, I got some good news this year. This year, my son's got us a boat. Well, he got it for me, but we're going to be working on it tomorrow. Checking out, make sure everything works, adjusts everything. It's a pretty nice little fishing boat. And we'll be fishing out of Oak Orchard Creek with it mainly. 
So I'm going to probably do a video of that tomorrow. I'm going down there in the afternoon. I'm going to work on the boat. Electric start. I got a fish finder put on it. Got a lot to do to it. Get it ready next week or so. I just missed a nice pike. He got my hook off. No steel leader on this, so I'm going to hook this up better. I think I got a couple leaders. Just lost a nice pike. I didn't even have the camera rolling when it got hit. And the bobber went down. Fish on. Fish on. <clears throat> Let them work the drag. Pretty good. Feels like a pretty good one. Feels like a pretty good one. I just keep it tight. Not bad. See, he's four or five pounds. A little bigger than the last one. We're going to get the hook out of him. I'm going to release him. We got another one in. Only got one piece of bait left. Only bought two shiners and cut them up. Pretty much used all the bait up. So. I'll put it on see if we can get another one. They're really hitting today. I think I lost four or five. Manda two. But I beat the skunk. Bobber's going down. See that bobber? Got him. Big old bullhead, boy. Wow. Look at there. Big old chunky bullhead. Fat boy, too. Wow. Nice one. Nice bullhead, Daddy got, bud. Oh, on the cut bait, on the cut chub. They like cut cut bait just like catfish. But there's no catfish at this end of the creek. At the other one towards this Genesee River there is. We're not up this far. Well, there we go, a nice little chunky bullhead. Little fat boy. Creek bullhead. All right, we're going to put her back. There she goes. A lot of bullhead in there, too. I've caught bullheads in here five pounds, and that's a monster bullhead. All right, let's get them bait back out there. I still got my bait. They didn't get it off, so. Only got two pieces of bait left. Looks like we're getting ahead already. I just put that back in there. Could be a school of bullheads on there, I'll bet you. We'll let them take it. Watch that bobber. I just threw it back in. It hasn't been in there 30 seconds. Mine's starting to tighten up. I'll 
see if I can hook it momentarily. There goes the bobbers going down. Got it. Got him. Oh, I got off. Damn. Ooh, I think it was a turtle. Soft part of it. Well, he got the bait. Got the last, last, well, I only got one piece and it's on the other pole. I think that was a snapping turtle that time. Well, Max and I are going to be packing up. And we did pretty good today. I'm leading the poles in while I'm packing up. Well, we're going to be packing up and headed out. We've been here like four hours and, you know, I don't want to overdo it. And get, I'm not hurting right now. My back's not killing me. It takes me a good 20 minutes just to load the van with all this stuff. Look at it. I mean, I got everything but a kitchen sink and a stove here. So it takes a while to load all this stuff up, but, you know, it's good to have. If you need something, I got it. Who knows? Okay, thanks for watching our videos, right, Max? Uh, he's suing us for resting whatever he's looking at. Max, thanks for watching our videos. May the good Lord take a liking to you. And don't let the game vultures get you. Don't let the game vultures get you, baby boy. They're coming for you. They're coming for you. Wow, you can cut bait fishing with Jerry and Max as a Jerry Sheffield production.